Uh, I'm talking here with a Laszlo. I've got his uh, YouTube UFO drone, 23rd of July. I'm enlarging the image now on the screen. And I've frozen the image at 59 seconds. And this was that UFO. And uh, Laszlo's on the phone with me. On the right side, looks like a, a rocket. I've enlarged those images. And that flies over at uh, 59 seconds. Now, if I take the video back to around 47 seconds, this is where it comes out of the cloud. That's your voice on there. This is where it f flashes. I see a flash. So this is the film. Uh, 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 Laszlo, which camera did you use for this? The Sony 850? Yes, um, Sony, one second, I tell you And here's the flash. Sony DCR-TRV 530 digital camera. Ah, the 530 you had. Now, at 40, at, on, at 46 seconds, I... I just freeze the image and you'll see that flash happening on top. Just let me. There it was. That's the flash on top. I then froze that image. And Steve, I used I used a movie uh, that uh, super nice shot position on and a few seconds that the uh, uh, IR 850. 850, yeah. Now one shoots, ah, Laszlo, I caught one more. It's coming from the right to the left, and it looks like a, a serpent. I saw something, something in the, the Yeah, uh, this is like a serpent at 50. This could be the same one that I caught in the image, but here it looks like it's curving. So I'll just take one picture now. Uh, and it looks curved like that serpent that you filmed once and, and I saw it looked like a serpent fly over this one okay I've quickly caught that image looks like a serpent and it shoots through at 59 se seconds uh, on the screen and it looks like a, a twisting serpent so just let me um, Freeze it at 58, 59. It will shoot out now from the right to the left. And there it is, like a huge serpent shoot over at fantastic speeds. Um, I'll then put the images on the phone zoom. I then can switch on to the computer, use a cable. And then I just, I just pause this video and then show the pictures enlargements on the video. So that's how that's how easy it is. Uh, 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 normally, a uh, Laszlo, when I do stuff, I quickly uh, I quickly have the camera. I, I plug the camera to my laptop. I then play the film. I use my iPhone. Well, this is HTC camera. I quickly take zoom pictures. I then uh, Zoom the moon, uh, the actual pictures. I download it and just quickly put on the uh, documentary. Ah, this is your zoom here at 4 minutes 43. It's not that clear. I think it's moved further away by then. Um, the best image is about. Aha, uh -huh. you've got. That's a good one. But I caught the best images about 45 seconds. And here it's a bit blurred. This is a bit blurred. Uh, uh. Yeah, because I did end up filming with an um, automata and the focus. Did the automata focus was on it? Because um, on a manual focus, it's, uh, it's uh, just getting out. I can't do it uh, that clear. With the manual focus, that's why I just uh, put them on uh, also on the focus and super natural position. Stay lucky. Very good capture. Little bit, little bit handshake, that's all. Now, this this is where. Too many people the brighter comment on my video. I used, I was supposed to be using the tripod, but when if I'm using a tripod, 
I can't capture them because they're, they're, I can't send them for too long. Yeah, that's right. Um, the and this was by accident. All the ones I catch, the this one, Laszlo. If you freeze it at fifty nine, you'll see what looks like that huge twisting serpent shoot. The one I caught on film. There it is. It shoots like a. Uh, I'll take one more picture. It it shoots like a twisting rocket. Unbelievable. I just take one more zoom now. Yep. It was very slowly moving, and what was uh, next to him is that uh, coming from, from right to left, that was very... So these are the images from Laszlo Novak's film, 23rd of July. So that's when I zoomed in on that uh, UFO, about 40, 40 seconds or so. And this one's unusual, so that's why I sort of had a closer look at these. They, they're not just the normal sh shape I expected. And... Uh, it looks like it's got processes coming out of there. That's it there again. There again. This is where I saw what looks like a triangular shape over it or some sort of wing shape. It's very unusual. And there was that 49 second. It went, there was a flash of light as though it had a helicopter type of a light at the end of it. It was just one flash and I froze it right there. So there it was and that flash happened right on top. That's it there. There was that object that streaked across. It, here it's straight but as it twists around it looks like a serpent shape. It spins around like a rocket. There's that UFO again. There it is. That's how it spins around. It's got that serpent shape to it. Now these are very common in Mexico, these serpent shapes. And I caught it just in a few frames. That's a good one. You just see the shape of it there. Um, that's it there. And it seems to displace the area around it as well, which is common with UFOs.